नमस्तेभ्य शुभमध्यान्ह तो अद पाठ चतुर्थपाठ अनुवर्तयाम त्र संख्या पठन क्रियते अस्मत अस्म प्रथमत एक एक प्रथमत पंचाशत पर्यत सम्यक्त अभी च दश दशका शतका यहाँ दश विशति त्रिशत चत्त पंचाशत षष्टि सप्तति अशीति नवति शत ज्ञात त्र विशदत एक आरभ्य पंचाशत पर्यत सूपवैखरी दृष्टवत किंचित एक पढ़िव ज्ञान प्राप्त अत्र इदानीं पंचाशत इति आरभ्य शत पर्यत रूपवैखरी कतम पश्याम अद तो झटिति एक पठा तदनतर काम अभी अथवा कि पुनः एक पठि आह्वयाम अहम तो साक्षा एक झटिति पढ़ि एक शुणु आग्रह कौमी यदि शक्य से म्यूट मध्ये एव स्थापय गृह उच्चती न यथा स्वयं श्रुत भवे तथा अपि उच्चारण कुरु अन्म्यूट मा कु तथा म्यूट मध्ये एव कुरु अस्तु पठा नंबर्स यू हैव लर्न नंबर्स अप टू फिफ्टी इन द प्रीवियस लेसन लर्न फ्रॉम फिफ्टी वन थ्रू हंड्रेड इन दिस लेसन एक पंचाशत द्विपंचाशत त्रिपंचाशत चतुपंचाशत पंचपंचाशत षटपंचाशत सप्तपंचाशत अष्टपंचाशत नवपंचाशत षि षि डोट नोटिस दट इट डजेंट हेव महाप्राण षि देकषि द्विषि चतुषि चतुषि पंचषि षटि सप्तषि अष्टि नवषि सप्तति एक सम्यक् सप्तति पुनः तथा एक सप्तति द्विसप्तति चतुसप्तति पंचसप्तति षटसप्तति सप्तसप्तति अष्ट अष्टसप्तति नवसप्तति अशीति एकाशीति द्व्यशीतिशीति चतुरशी पुनः क्षम्यता चतुरशीति पंचाशीति षडशीति सप्ताशीति अष्टाशीति नवाशीति नवति दीर्घ पश्यता पंचाशीति सप्ताशीति अष्टाशीति नवाशीति किमर्थम अशीति अकार आरप्स्यते किल तहुत्र दीर्घ दृश्य है नवति एकनवति द्विनवति त्रिनवति चतुर्नवति पंचनवति षण्णवति षण्णवति सप्तनवति अष्टनवति नवनवति शत अशीतिर कि वैचित्र अस्म ज्ञात तशीति दीर्घ तदनतर द्व्यशीति यकार आयोग 
त्र्यशीति योग चतुरशीति चतु अची अशीति चतुरशीति रेपस्य अकार से संयोग त्र पंच अशीति पंचाशीति दीर्घ षडशीति षट अशीति टकार डकारेण पिवर्तन भूत्वा तदनतर अकार योजन डी षडशीति सप्त अधिक अशीति सप्ताशीति पुनः तथा अष्टाशीति नवाशीति दीर्घ सवर्ण दीर्घ तथा दृष्ट अत्र षण्णवती षट प्लस नवति षण्णवती त्र टकार नकार पिवर्तन संजात to soften the takara gets converted to nakara and then the two nakaras get converted to nakara okay so there is some prakriya afoot if you notice ana is easier to pronounce after sh okay so it is depending on the mouth organization accordingly the softening is also directed to some other modification instead of shan shanavati trying to say sh and then double nakara is very difficult if you notice so it is easier to roll it as a na so shannavati it's very natural in the mouth so extremely important transformations okay not meaningless so that much shatam is uh, sounding quite different from the other guys but something you have to be aware shatam okay ha uh, idanim mm, kama khoyami सप्तिपर्यत पठत विसर्जनीय से अथवा विसर्ग से पिवर्तन किंचुपंचाशत चतुपंचाशत चतुपंचाशतुपंचाशतुपंचाशतुपंचाशतुपंचाशतुपंचाशतुपंचाशतुपंचाशतुपंचाशतुपंचाशतुपंचाशतुपंचाशतुपंचाशतुपंचाशत
ಅಷ್ಟಾಶೀತಿ ಬಹು ಸಮ್ಯಕ್ ಪಠಿತ ಕಂ ಕೂರು ಆರಭ್ಯ ಶಿಖಿ ಸಂಸ್ಕೃತ ಸಂಸ್ಕೃತ ತೂಪವೈಖರೀ ಲಿಖಿ ಸಂಸ್ಕೃತ ಸಂಜ್ಞಾನ ಉಪಯೋಗೇನ ಸಂಖ್ಯಾನ ಸೂಚನಾ ಯದಿ ತದಿ ಎತದಿ ಎತದಿ ಆಂಗ್ಲ ಕಾಲ ನಾಶ್ಯತೆ ಆಂಗ್ಲ ಸಂಖ್ಯಾ ಕಾಲ ನಾಶ್ಯತೆ ಪ್ರಥಮ ತೃತೀಯ ಕಾಲ ಸ್ವಹಸ್ತೇನ ಪತ್ರ ಸಜ್ಜೀಕೃತ್ಯ ಸ್ವಹಸ್ತೇನ ಲಿಖಿ ಪತ್ರ ಸಜ್ಜೀಕೃತ್ಯ ಪುನಃ ಪುನಃ ಪಠಂತು ಯಾಕದಿ ತರ್ಹಿ ಮನಸಿ ಸ್ಥಾಪಿತ ಸ್ವಪ್ರಯತ್ನ ಲಿಖಿ ತದೇವ ಪುನಃ ಪುನಃ ಯಾಕದಿ ಪಠಂತು ಯಥಸಿ ಏಕವಾರಿಷ್ಟೇತ್ ಅಸ್ತು ವಾ ಹಾ ಇದಿ ಅಗ್ರೆ ಗಮಿಷ್ಯಾಮ ಅತ್ರ ಅಭ್ಯಾಸ ಯತ್ ಪಠಿತ ವ್ಯಾಕರಣ ವಿಷಯ ಉಪರಿ ತೇಷಾಂಕೃತೆ ಕೇಚನ ಅಭ್ಯಾಸ ಅತ್ರ ದತ್ತಿ ಉತ್ತರ ದ್ರ ಪ್ರಥಮ ಮನಸಿ ಸ್ಥಾಪಿತ ಅಧಾವತ್ ಅಧಾವತ್ ಅಧಾವನ್ ಅಧಾವ ಅಧಾವತ್ ಅಧಾವತ ಅಧಾವ ಅಧಾವಾವ ಅಧಾವಾಮ ಧಾವ ಧಾತೋ ಎಮೇವ ಅಗಚ್ಛತ್ ಅಗಚ್ಛತ ಅಗಚ್ಛನ್ ಅಗಚ್ಛ ಅಗಚ್ಛತ ಅಗಚ್ಛತ ಅಗಚ್ಛ ಅಗಚ್ಛಾವ ಅಗಚ್ಛಾಮ ಅತ್ರ ಪ್ರಾಯ ಧಾವ್ ಧಾತೋ ವಕಾರ ಕಿಂಚಿತ್ ಅನ್ಯಾಂ ಪ್ರಸಕ್ತಿ ಕಿಂಚಿತ್ ಭಿನ್ನ ಸ್ಯಾತ್ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಯ ನಾಸ್ತಿ ಧಾತೋ ಭಾಗ ತತ್ ಅತ್ ಆಮ್ ಅನ್ ಎತದೇವ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಯ ತೇವ ಅವಹ ಅತ ಅವತ ಅತ ಕ್ಷಮ್ಯತ ಅತ ಅತ ಅಂ ಆವ ಆಮ ಅಸ್ತು ತು ಕ್ರೌಡ್ ಸೋರ್ಸ್ ಕರ್ತು ಶಕ್ನು ಚಾತ್ರ ಪಠತಿ ದತ್ತಮಸ್ತಿ ತಸ್ಯವ ಲಂಗ್ಲಕಾರೆ ಕಥಂ ಬವತಿ ಸೂಚನೀಯ ಅಸ್ಮ ಚಾತ್ರ ಅಪಠತ್ತಿ ಬವತಿ ಚಾತ್ರ ಇದಿ ಪಠತಿ ಹ್ಯ ಚಾತ್ರ ಅಪಠತ್ತಿ ಸಾಂದತಿ ಕಥಂ ಭೂತಕಾಲೆ ಶುನಕಾಶನೀಯ ಅಭಶನ್ ಅಭಶನ್ ನಕಾರ ಅನ್ ಅಗಚ್ಛನ್ ಅಭಶನ್ ಸಮ್ಯಕ್ 
ओके अत्र पश्यतु अत्र कर्तरी प्रयोग है न्यास्यते इति अस्ति इति इतने बहुवचने लट्लकारे परस आत्मने पदी न परस्म पदी अतः अत्र परस्म पदी रूपमे करणीय हाँ पूर्ण सारी पर्ण पतति लिखति एज न Uh, especially after you get told you do that so uh, because you will find others are not able to appreciate you much <laughs> i'm sorry <laughs> okay so you find culprits of the same age so a friend of the same age is vyasya how scientifically beautifully coined the name for a friend is i clapped at it because it ex- explains an entire uh, methodology of who is a friend anyway वयम 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 वेरी गुड सिमिलर टू दैट वयम यूयम यूयम सम्यक महाप्रण नास्ति अल्प प्रण अखादत खाई महाप्रण परंतु लट्लकारे महाप्राणमासी योगेन तत्र महाप्राण न बवति इति नास्ति इति तत् ज्ञातव्यम अस्मापि ओके बट इट वोट बी लाइक कलाज लेर इफ यू एंड पुटिंग महाप्राण बिकॉज जनरली वी थिंक मध्यम पुरुष एज ए महाप्राण इन दंड एज ए हेबिट सो बट वी शुड नोटिस वेर दे आर नाट देर ओके इन दिस पर्टिक्युलर केस देर इज नो महाप्राण प्रत्यय ओके Uh, it's a little off putting but some that's what it is okay tvam dhavasi tvam adavaha adavaha already there answer standing <laughs> staring at us luckily it mapped the dhatu also tvam adavaha samyak natyah nrityanti natyah anrityan anrityan samyak अनृत्यन से नाउ इदानीम किंचित सुलभः अभवत् किमर्थं सुलभः सर्वं परस्मैपदी दाथूनाम एव क्रियापदानाम सूचना अस्ति अत्र यदि मध्ये मध्ये आत्मनेपदी दाथूनाम अपि योगः भवति तर्हि मनसि किंचित क्लेशः भवति अत्र अत्र किं तत्र किं इति तु द्वाभ्याम अपि अभ्यासः करणीयः अत्र तु किं कृतं तैः प्रथमं परस्मैपदी धातूनाम एव उपयोग कृता तैः अस्तु चेंज इंटू प्लूरल नंबर उदाहरण छात्र प्रश्न अपृछत् छात्रा प्रश्न अपृछन नोटिस देर इज नो एनफोर्समेंट टू कन्वर्ट द कर्म पद इंटू बहुवचन जस्ट नौ वी लर्ट दैट इन कर्तरी वेन वी से प्लूरलिटी इट इज टिपिकली फॉर कर्ता एंड क्रिया okay it won't be a mistake if you end up making the karma pada plural but that is not changing any influence on the kriya pada it is not a wrong answer to pluralize karma pada but generally many places karna karma pada cannot be pluralized for example chatrah jalam apibat is there okay chatrah jalan jalani apibat you don't say jalani na each of them drinks a glass of water we still say jalam only collective noun in singular so we have to be cautious with multiplying karma pada okay uh, it sometimes doesn't suit the language okay the context it won't fit okay so many times it will fit it won't be incorrect but generally there is no compulsion on you to multiply the karma pada especially in kartari prayoga when we ask for plurality 
switching. Okay. So remember that. So chatraha prashnam apruchan. Choraha dhanam aharat. Choraha dhanam aharan. 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 Very good. So T goes to N. Very straightforward. T goes to N. So what one R at an. Hmm? Very easy. So uh, sa patram akshalayat. Te sa patram akshalayat. 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 Ah, what is akshalayatam business? Why akshalayatam? Akshalayan. Akshalayan. See, there is no pulling a strilling of her kriyapada. Please don't get confused. Okay. Sometimes we associate this an an with the pulling a because you know so kritavan, gatavan, like that. We think this is something like that. But no, this is not a kritanta in masculine or anything. This is actually a kriyapada, adhavan. So there is no pums, pum, pulling atva or strilling atva in that. So don't get confused. Okay. Akshalayat akshalayan. That's all. Very straightforward. So okay. We can also use taha, te or taha. Why te? How, how do you decline sa? Te, can you tell Bagini? Uh, sa here is she. Is it Correct. she? Correct. Okay. okay. How do you decline it? Ah, that only I don't remember. Sa te taha. It is there ah, on the screen. It is there on the screen. Sa te taha. Yes. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So you cannot say te, te will be dvivachana. The question ah, is asking is, uh, into plural, okay? Not into dual, okay? So we should go taha patram akshalayan. So taha patram akshalayan. Okay, good. Aham vakyam asmaram. Vayam vakyam asmaram. asmaram. Asmarama. Asmarama. Very good. Asmarama. Vayam Vakyam Asmarama. Asmarama. Actually, Vayam Vakyam Vismarama. <laughs> we'll forget. Okay, but anyway, that Vismarama yes. is uh, uh, Vyasmarama. I think there is a V plus A. So there may be a N. Vyasmarama may be the form. Okay. Anyway, we will not introduce any uh, new Upasargas there to confuse us. Vayam Vakyam Asmarama. We won't forget. <laughs> oh, sorry, we will forget. <laughs> Again, I got stumped. A uh, is not negator. Like Mahavya, sometime back said, we tend to feel that there is a negation there. It is not. This is just Bhutakala. So, Smarama, Asmarama, we, we will rem we remembered in the past. Okay. Tvam Vakyam Avadaha. Yuyam Vakyam Vakyam Avadata. Avadata. Very good. Yuyam Vakyam Avadata. Some people start confidently and when the verb comes, they stop talking. Okay. So, <laughs> all right. Saha Yanam Achalayat. Te Yanam Achalayat. Ah, one of the beginning strong there. Stay yanam achalayan. They started the vehicle in the past. Or drove the vehicles in the past. Okay. Sevakaha baram avahat. Sevakaha baram avahan. Avahan. Very good. Sevakaha baram avahan. Sakshiram apibat. Especially here, we cannot make it Kshirani. Okay, Kshiram meva, it will remain. So, Kshiram apibat, Taha Kshiram apiban. Very simple. Okay, Palaha Katam Alikat. Balaha Katam Alikan. So everywhere, because it starts with akara, all the karmas have the halantam akara ending instead of the normal anuswara bindu that would appear. So that is just because of the uh, thing we already learned when to change the halantam akara to bindu only if there is a vyanjana akshara there. Since it's a swarakshara, we don't change. Okay. All right. So some more exercises. We can continue to stay unmuted. Those of you who are participating, 
i request uh, others also to participate as per their desire i know you 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 will in the crowd will i be heard type of thing but at least mouth the answers in your respective places so that you know okay i didn't uh, say that right so i need to practice at least you will wake up and realize i will practice a little bit later okay that's why you should try study the verbal forms in the following examples and write their singular and plural number forms in the of past tense in the respective person so now they have pushed up the difficulty level so they had kept it fairly easy for us so far now they have pushed it up so they will give for example vandate you have to first go to past tense avandata and then go to its plural so you should recall both forms okay now i have made it all very easy for you i put this table hopefully this should stick in your brain okay uh, in the exam when when i had to go to the hall and write the exam no what i would do is uh, anyway you will get your answer script in your hand uh, some 20 minutes earlier only right they will start distributing all that they do that so that you prepare putting your name registration number etc what i do would do is instead of wasting time time twiddling my thumb i would uh, rattle in from my oral memory i would rattle the charts that i know and just uh, jot them down in uh, readable form on the last uh, sheet okay later can be crossed off okay so you can do that kind of exercise for you know the four lakaras that we are going to learn whatever few lakaras that we are going to learn in this for one dhatu remember it for gam dhatu for parasmai padi and uh, vand dhatu for atmane padi and just note it down quickly there okay so and similarly you can note down a few declension of one or two popular nouns also so that you will get helped okay then um, uh, uh, similarly maybe sankhyas maybe if you have little more time write down the sankhyas uh, as much as you can okay so this thing is going to become a easy reference for you through the exam okay later you can just put a mild cross across it and leave it it's not an illegal practice to use your oral recall to note down so that you can accurately answer okay i i, I used to do that trick okay hmm. even then there may be errors but we will reduce that sir okay ha slaghate 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 हिंदी ओके हां त्रायते अत्रायते अगेन समबडी सेड अत्रायते 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 संस्कृत रिक्वायर्स वेरी क्लियर टंग यूसेज एंड क्लियर एंडिंग्स एक्यूरेट एंडिंग्स वंदे एकार इज ए प्रत्यय पार्ट ऑफ द लटलकार यू कैन ब्रिंग इट इन टू द पास्ट टेन्स ऑल्सो ओके सो भाष सो अभाषत अभाषंत ओके सहसे मिस्टेक्यूड इन प्रथम पुरुष ओके Uh, I also got sold a dummy as I was preparing this. Okay, now till now everything was prathama purusha, slagate, modate, trayate, aham vande. I made a mistake again there. Okay, bhashe was uttama purusha, sahase tvam. So there are three incorrect answers there. 
okay oh. what you guys need to do is take my edit and we'll correct it okay so that you know again you won't lose marks in the exam like i would do if i so avandata is the incorrect is not the incorrect answer but for the question it is incorrect okay so avande see because you see avardhe avande so okay avande avanda mahi okay i noticed it only mm. late i'm sorry okay then abhashe bhashe is uttama purusha so abhashe somebody was saying it right and i discouraged them and got confused myself i apologize okay abhasha mahi thank you mm. okay sahase is madhyama purusha so okay so we have to go asahar ahasahataah असहता महाप्राण ओके असहता असहद्वम सो यू आर नोटिसिंग द डिफिकल्टी लेवल हियर आई ऑलरेडी गुफ्ड अप क्लियरली इन द स्क्रीन भाषसे अगेन मध्यम पुरुषा अभाषे अभाषसे अभाषतम अभाषद्वम ओके then shankate uh, uh, it is actually back to prathama purusha okay ashankata ashankata ashankanta ashankanta as i have already disclaimed that so you guys got it right okay so i had 3 4 errors there thanks that we got it corrected so maybe what i should do is Okay, this will help to know what is happening there. For future, I have done that. So thanks for your patience. Every time I try to improve the slides like this. When I teach only, I notice the stupidities. Okay, so fill in the blanks with the past tense verbal form of the root uh, mentioned so, in so bracket. So past tense, sir. Huh, madam. Do uh, you pronounce uh, the uh, the eighth one or shank the plural form? Ashankanta, Ashankanta. Ashankanta. अशंकंता जस्ट लाइक अवर्धंता शंक अंत अशंकंता ओके हाँ नाउ फिल द फिल इन द ब्लैंक्स विद द पास टेंस वर्बल फॉर्म ऑफ द रूट मेंशन इन ब्रैकेट्स नाउ दे टुक इट वन मोर स्टेप सी अर हियर हियर दे हैड गिवन द लटलाकार अ फुल फॉर्म सो दैट मेंटली वी कैन रन इट एंड डू द थिंग नाउ दे आर just giving uh, the dhatu and asking you to put it so baktah devam yach so baktah devam ayachata so because baktah is prathama purusha right third person immediately so it's ekavachana so make the dhatu go to past tense in prathama ekavachana so ayachata avardhata ayachata yach dhatu okay that is the technique now uh here it happened to be prathama purusha ekavachana other places it may be other things again we have to be cautious like you know reading the purusha and the vachana from the latlakara here we have to read it from the karta see there we read it from the reference of the dhatu in latlakara here we have to read it from the karta's uh, uh, vachana uh, and whether the karta is madhyama or uttama like aham mar uh, tvam mar uyam those things we have to notice okay so that is the trick now but once we know what is the trick then we can do it right it's only a matter of memorizing that's all okay rugnah vedanam saha asahata asahata correct asahata past tense sahate in lat asahata in lang okay asahata So that means the the 
the diseased person the pain he bore bore the pain he withstood the pain that's what it means okay te lajj ಅಲಜ್ಜತ <laughs> those two ladies they feel lajja that is also correct okay now here i am assuming there are a set of males who formed uh, who had the lajja bhava why not so we don't need to associate only femininity with lajja right so i took the pullinga in this answer you can take a strilling answer also we are getting a taste of all the trouble i have preparing all these things thanks for <laughs> yes so we get that alajjatam strilinga okay ha huh. actually i should have put dvivachana but it's okay it's obvious so we'll leave it so vrukshaha kamp vrukshaha vrukshaha akampanta correct akampanta vrukshaha akampanta many trees they they shook in the in the star master day or something like that how can you say in the star master day guys can you say vrukshaha in the star master day akampanta can someone try in the star storm in the star master day storm uh, what is the word for star ಡ್ಯೂರಿಂಗ್ ರೈನ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ the storm is also interpreted as rain in english okay karunaha spard karunaha aspardanta aspardanta super plural very easy sainikaha yudh sainikaha ayudanta ayudanta ukraine nagare sainikaha ಅಯುದ್ಧಂತ ಇದಿ ಯುದ್ಧಿ ಅಯುಧ್ಯಂತ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ದಿವಾದಿ ಗಣ ಭಾನ್ ಸಮ್ಯಕ್ ಯುದ್ಧಿ ಕೇಮ್ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಇನ್ ಲಾಟ್ ಬಟ್ ಅಯು ಅಯುಧಂತ ಇವೆಂಟ್ ಅಯುಧ್ಯಂತ so this guy guys thanks mahodaya so this dhatu is a little tricky it belongs to a gana chaturtha gana called divadi gana where there is a yakara insertion happening okay so ayudhyanta yud yudhyanta will come okay yudhyate yudhyete yudhyante in uh, uh, in lat and in uh, uh, lang it is lang ayudhyata ayudhyetam ayudhyanta it will be interesting to write down this once to remember that there is this trick with some dhatus okay okay chhatraah khid akhidyante here also yakara akhidyanta ah it also comes to us little bit because khidanta sounds all odd So remember, okay, Yakara, perhaps like that. Akhidyante. 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 This one, Chaturtha, Shashka, Evam, Saptama Ganeshu, Evam. Chaturtha Gane, Divadi Gane, Yudhasit. Tataiva, Kinchit Prasakti, Shashka Gane, Apicha, Saptama Gane, Api Asti. Yakara Siya Yoga. Janaha, Mod. 
ಅಮೋದಂತ ಆಲ್ಮೋಸ್ಟ್ ಎವ್ರಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಸೋ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಗೇವ್ ಇನ್ ಪ್ರಥಮ ಪುರುಷ ಓಕೆ ಎವ್ರಿಥಿಂಗ್ ವಾಸ್ ಇನ್ ಪ್ರಥಮ ಪುರುಷ ಇಟ್ ವಾಸ್ ಆಲ್ ಈಸಿ ಯು ಎಂ ಶಂ ಮಧ್ಯಮ ಪುರುಷ ಬಹುವಚನ ಏ ಉತ್ತಮ ಪುರುಷ ಐತಿ ಲಿಖಿತಮ್ಮಯ್ಯ ಮಧ್ಯಮ ಪುರುಷ ಓಕೆ so we finished this exercise as ha one doubt sorry ha 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 ask bagini ha uh, second one ke lajja uh, in streelinga is it not alat alat je alat je tam alat je tam you are right alat je tam alat je tam ekara is there you are correct avar je tam avar alat je tam correct thank you okay so we finish this so we will go to one more exercise so now this is a interesting exercise you have to mark it as transitive or intransitive sakarmaka or akarmaka based on your analysis but they have very carefully avoided giving the karma pada what you have to now think is can i put one am i am i qualified to put one you have to mentally think of course they are not expecting you to have some ashtadhyayi ganapata knowledge of dhatus from which you know they are expecting you to try it out mentally can i ask the question kim patati kim nayati kim vikasati kim rakshati like that and see if i can get an answer okay try this exercise right try this questioning exercise and come with that बालिका पठति बालिका पुस्तक अथवा पाठ बालिका पाठ पठति सेवक नयति सेवक ವಸ್ತು ನಯತಿ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ಭಾರಂ ನಯತಿ ಪತ್ ಪಾತ್ರ ಸೋ ಮೆನಿ ಇಯರ್ಸ್ ಐ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಲೇಟರ್ ನಯತಿ ಹಾ ಪುಷ್ಪ ವಿಕಸತಿ ಅಕರ್ಮಕ ಯು ಕನಾಟ್ ಸೇ ಕಿಂ ವಿಕಸತಿ ಪುಷ್ಪಮೇವ ವಿಕಸತಿ ತತ್ರ ಕಿಲ ತತ್ರ ಫಲಾಶ್ರಯ ವ್ಯಾಪಾರಶ್ರಯ ಪುಷ್ಪ ಅಸ್ತಿ ತರ್ಹಿ ಷ್ಟಿಸತಿ ಜಿತ್ರಿಶ್ಯತಿ ಉಪವಿಶತಿ ಧಾತುಟಿವ್ Okay. Um, 
you can use two types of karmapada okay I, not in the sense of one is like a visheshana to the other remember when we say dvikarmaka we don't mean one karmapada is a visheshana to another karmapada that can happen many number of times for example sundaram mukham vikasati sundaram is not any additional uh, uh, karta there it is a qualifier to mukham similarly take for a karmapada balika prathamam paatham patati it is not dvikarmaka prayoga prathamam paatham prathamam is a qualifier to paatham so it is not a new karmapada it is a associated karmapada to paatham but in a dvikarmaka there is a nature of uh, do qualities of karmapada okay again the grammarians will go into details of that we will we will not uh, trouble you too much with that but remember that there are things like that okay Hmm. So, Shishu who Rodhiti, this is strange. Datu Rodhiti. Akarmakaha. Akarmakaha. It will cry for no reason. How can we? <laughs> Mothers know it is Akarmakaha. <laughs> okay. So, Shishu who Rodhiti, Grihe, Atava Bahi, Sarvatra, Rodhiti, <laughs> like this kid, cute one. Bhaktaha Namati. Sakarmakaha. 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 Devam Namati. Hmm. Bhakta. Oh, I have, I have changed the example to something else here. I am sorry. I think cut paste error from Devaha Bhakta and Rakshati. Lot of edit in this sheet. I will do that afterwards. Okay. Gajaha Tishtati. Akarmakaha. Ah, akarmakaha. Tishtati, Upavishati, uh, Uttishtati. These are all Akarmaka. Okay, Thadatu essentially. <laughs> okay, and then Vish Datu. Hmm. Okay, so Akar Gajaha Tishtati. Hmm. Vane Nadi Tate Tishtati. Like this. This is Adhikarana. This is not a Karmapada. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, guys, so that was a good exercise. So we'll keep flowing on. Vya Vyavaharika Shabdaha. Vyavaharika Shabdas of today are all the various names for the parts of our body very interesting so keshaha hair kapolaha cheek oshtaha all are in singular by the way all are in singular oshtaha lip oshtau two lips so when we use some of them we use in dvivachana because essentially we don't refer to one we refer to two of them oshtau so dvivachana usage is so natural because many things we have two two hands two legs two Two kapolas, two oshtas, like this. Okay, two karanas, two akshinis, etc. Dantaha, tooth. Dantaha, tooth. Hmm? Dantaha, plural. Karanaha, ear. Karanau, two ears. Kantaha, neck. Luckily, we have only one. <laughs> Skandaha, shoulder. We have two. Skandhau. Hmm? Bujaha, arm. Little bit, um, there is, uh, you can actually replaceably use Kanda Buja for similar reference. Okay. Buja is also meaning actually upper arm. So, little bit of shoulder sense is involved. But Skanda is more the bony top of the shoulder, and Buja is more the muscular part of the shoulder. Okay. Little bit. Okay. Bujaha arm is a little extension. They have used it because they are going to use hand next. Okay. Hastaha hand. Okay, hastaha also we can translate to palm also. Okay, uh, but you can generally use that for whole hand also. Hastaha hand. Okay, nakaha nail, nakaha nail, shurpanaki. <laughs> shurpanaki. So some people confuse shurpanaki to mean sharp nailed lady, right? She is not, of course, her nail is sharp, no doubt. But she is called Shurpanapi Naki because Shurpa is what in Sanskritam? Do you guys know? Shurpaha? Okay, silence. Shurpaha means the winnowing basket. Okay, uh, Mora in Kannada. The, the, the bamboo basket you use for uh, um, taking uh, husk out of grains and all that. You do that tuck, 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 and the gray, the husk falls off in the in the wind. So that is called shurpaha. So shurpanaki is 
Shurpanakha is also used. Shurpanakhi is also used in a kind of variant form. Shurpanakha may be the original form in Sanskritam. It is because <laughs> her being a Rakshasi, her nails are as broad as a winnowing basket. <laughs> so you can imagine the terror <laughs> in people. Okay, all right. Padaha foot. Uruhu thai. Okay, Uruhu thai. Then Nasika nose. Jihwa, jih, jihwa, jiv, jivha is very difficult to pronounce anyway. So jihwa, natural order. Jihwa, tongue. Then jangha, jangha, leg from the ankle they say. But you can roughly take it as the that knee uh, and the back strong portion of the lower leg as jangha. Okay. Uruhu being thai, jangha is the muscular part below. Okay. Roughly that. Okay. Um, then there is uh, fr uh, from the knee to the ankle, little bit that ank knee. This, I don't know how this term is. I don't know if it's an editor or what is that. Anyway, so jangha bala, we say no, that means actually ability to run that comes from uru and the muscles below jangha. Largely jangha participates. Any runner knows that the lower leg, that portion plays a colossal role in, in movement. Anguli, finger. Okay, so angulyaha, plural. Hmm. Mastakam, head. Okay, shiraha is also head. Okay, mastakam, napumsakalinga, head. Lalatam, forehead. Okay, this part, lalatam. Okay, there is a beautiful verse, no? Lalate, vasate, lakshmi, something, something like that. Okay, ha, netram, eye. Netram, eye. There are many other names, chakshuhu, uh, ak akshaha. Something like that. Okay. Uh, all right. Netram, we will take easy one. Netram, I. Mukham, mouth. Sometimes people confuse mukham with the face because in local language we use it for face. But in Sanskritam, mukham means mouth. Okay. Uh, you can extend it to face, but there is another beautiful word for face. Vadanam, vadanam, face. Okay. Hmm. Uh, vakshastalam, chest. Vakshastalam. Vakshastalam, chest. Okay. Raktam, blood. Very easy to remember. Janu, knee. See, different from jangha. Janu is the actual bony knee. Janga is the muscular part below. Okay. Uru is the thigh. Janga may, may refer to the back uh, muscles below the, the lower thigh also. I mean, behind portion of the thigh also, it might refer to. But I, I think Janga is more the, I will find a picture which points correctly. Okay, Janga is probably the muscles behind the lower leg. Mm. Then, uh, Janu, then Charma, skin. We know that, Charma, skin, see, Napumsaka. <laughs> charma. Mm. Okay, I wish they had given the Linga. It's not obvious everywhere. Uh, but mostly you can pick up pullingas, strilingas, napumsakalingas. If you notice one thing what Sanskrit Bharati does is they try not to mix up, though they are not. That's why sometimes you think they are not going in order. But roughly all pullingas, many strilingas, and then napumsakalingas, mastaka manwards. Okay. So I hugely suspect Janu and Charma are in the napumsakalinga class. I wish I put a line and a color variation to show that. Okay. Maybe that's a value addition I should be doing. So, okay. Keshaha, Kapolaha, Oshtaha, Dantaha, Karnaha, Kantaha, Skandaha, Bujaha, Hastaha, Nakaha, Padaha, Uruhu, Nasika, Jihwa, Janga, Anguli, Mastakam, Lalatam, Netram, Mukham, Vadanam, Vakshasthalam, Raktam, Janu, Charma. Okay. Fine. <clears throat> Prahelika. Okay. So today's puzzle goes like this. Okay. Purushaha ki drusho veti prayena sakalaha kalaha madhya varna dvayam tyaktva bruhika syat suralaya. Purushaha ki drusho veti prayena sakalaha kalaha 
Very easy meaning. Purushaha, a man. Kidrishaha, of what nature? Veti, knows. Veti means knows. Okay, janati, veti. Okay, prayena, perhaps. Sakalaha, every, all. Kalaha, talents or uh, knowledge, uh, natures of talents. Okay, all right. So, which is this man who knows perhaps all the kalas? Okay. Madhya Varnadvayam Tyaktva. So, after you find some name for that, answering that, Madhya Varnadvayam Tyaktva, dropping the two Varnas in the middle of that word. So, at least that word will have four letters, is clear to us, because we have to drop two letters in the middle. That means there has to be one left in the end and one in the beginning. Most likely, it will be two letters left. They won't complicate us. Okay. So, Bruhi Kaha Syat Suralayaha. Tell me who perhaps is equivalent to Suralayaha. Suralayaha, don't confuse it with uh, bar. Okay. <laughs> Many people look at Suralaya and think, okay, Griham is Mane, Alaya is Mane. So, Suralaya must be drinking Mane. No, no, no. Suranam Alaya. Suraha means Devaha. Guys, Indra Loka. Okay. Suralaya is Indra Loka. It might have also have a bar, as many uh, strange stories tell us, but don't worry about that bar. Okay. So, Suralaya is our Indra's world. He has enough trouble keeping his kingdom to worry about drinking. <laughs> and he is only dispatching his Apsaras everywhere for solving problems. <laughs> so, I don't think it's much fun. Okay. If you read uh, uh, later on in the second level or third level, you will get stories of um, of Raghu Vamsha. So there is this story in the Raghu Vamsha of Raghu, the uh, Dilipa's son Raghu. Okay, <laughs> he is a big king in the lineage of uh, Rama's Vamsha. He would have fought with uh, Indra and all that. So <laughs> yeah, some stories comes like that. So he's always fighting. Uh, are otherwise doing some mischief. <laughs> Not a great character, I would say, Indra. <laughs> okay. So, we have to find the answer, two-letter answer after dropping that, which is equivalent to Swarga, which is one of the possibilities. So, Swar dash dash Grga could be one, one answer. But there could be other two-letter names for Swarga. We have to know them. Then, we have to construct this. Okay, so this one is not very easy because not very obvious. Purushaha, Kidrishaha, Veti, Prayana, Sakalaha, Kalaha, we keep coming with Panditaha, something like that, right? Panditaha, some other uh, Gnani. How do we come with a four letter word? It's not very easy. Okay, so anyway, they have given the English of this. What does one call a person who is well versed in all branches of learning? In that word, if two letters in the middle are omitted, then the remaining letters give the meaning heaven, which is that word. Okay. So that's what I have broken it down here. Anvaya of that. Yaha purushaha sakalaha kalaha prayena veti saha kidrishaha syat. Tasmin pade madhya varanadvayam tyaktva yat padam prapyate suralayaha kahasyat ityasya uttaram bhavati tat. Padam tatvam bruhi. Swargaha Suranam Alayaha, hmm, abode of gods. But this is not the answer. Swargaha won't fit the bill. Okay. Um, because Swar, then what, what, Gaha, we will say. What, what, or Gaha. I don't remember any word for Pandita, which is like that. Okay. So, should I open up or you guys uh, know it? Some answer? Okay. <laughs> okay, we'll open it up. It's okay. Huh? So the answer is Nagari Kaha. Okay. So Sahakidr Shahasyat Nagari Kaha. Cultured fella is called Nagari Kaha. Basically, Nagare Asti Iti Nagari Kaha. Nagare Asti Janaha Eshaha Iti Nagari Kaha. So uh, city city block. Now not your modern Bangalore city block. Okay. This is, uh, if you remember, in the ancient times, uh, people who didn't deserve to be in the capital city couldn't be there, right? 
they they will be uh, there is no bikari bikari support system <laughs> okay so people who are in nagara means they are as part of the asthana so they are there all of them are there because they have some talent to help the king run the kingdom so rest of them are engaged in whatever they do like uh, in you know they are either pandits in temple or gurus in gurukulas they are not sitting there in the nagara wasting their time okay so are they are krishikas working on the bhumi etc so nagarika in the ancient times meant somebody who is a kalavanta kala he knows some kala and is useful to the court so remember this is in the context of uh, good old ancient india when uh, becoming a city dweller meant something okay not a last resort to survive okay so nagarika and if you remove if you remove gari then nakah comes nakah is actually a paryaya pada for swargah okay nakah suranam alaya abode of gods so one who knows all branches nagarika if the middle letter naka remains which means heaven so in the in the question paper you have to say this don't don't copy cat this word sometimes when i look at answer sheets people will just write exactly what is there in textbook you get disappointed i put some effort to explain this verse in you know over words a little bit in your own words once you know the answer there is no need to use the same english as in the textbook etc in this covid times of course you have access to the textbook textbook but please uh, use your own words at least what we hope is that when you answer the question you are studying the subject okay all right i am sure none of you guys who are attending here will do that but anybody who hears this recording later might benefit from my appeal okay so with that we concluded the prahelika sangrahya vishayah hmm. let us see if we can move a little bit more huh? i know we are at the boundary of 4 o'clock let's take a few minutes sangrahya vishayah shiva today it is our shiva okay Mm. one who was uh, sadly the subject of uh, many abuse today anyway harah papani harata shivo dattam sada shivam na janami tino bruyat sarvagnya pada bhagyatah harah papani harata shivo dattam sada shivam न जानामीति नो ब्रूयात सर्वज्ञ पद बाग्यतः ओके सो व्हाट इज इट मीन इट्स नॉट सो इजी टू ब्रेक डाउन लेट अस सी द मीनिंग दे हैव गिवन एंड सी इफ वी कैन वर्क बैक फ्रॉम द वर्स आल्सो द अंडरस्टैंडिंग द ईच वर्ड क्लियरली ओके मे लॉर्ड शिवा रिमूव द सिन्स ओके हरह अस्माकं पापानि हरतात full stop okay so bharatat is in the vidhi form so mehi will come so mehi remove hara means to steal remove okay so mehi remove our sins his name hara is because of that he removes our sins okay one way or the other when we are still living or when he shows us the door <laughs> ओके सो हर पापा हरता मे हि रिमूव अवर से मे लॉर्ड शिव रिमूव अवर से ओके शिव दत्ता सदा शिव शिव दत्ता सदा शिव अगेन देर इज एन अपील से मे लॉर्ड शिव बेस्टो आस्पीशियस्नेस ऑन अस् आलवे सदा आलवे शिव मंगल आस्पीशियस्ने मंगल सदा मंगल दत्ता Uh, mehi shiva again another paryaya for uh, shiva so hara shiva this is the most default name we take mahadeva shiva these are the most default hara is also there we know that hara hari hara hari and hara are used for vishnu and shiva right ha then na janami iti nah bruyat nah it's uh, uh, actually janami iti nah na bruyat iti asti kila no iti prayah atra nah iti na karaniyam prayah nah is is a paryaya for asman 
so maybe that is not to be changed. There is an avyaya no, which is same as na. Okay. So I will take that interpretation for now. Okay. So na janami iti na bruyat. So bruyat is again similar to haratat mehi not. Okay. So mehi not tell. So na bruyat means may mehi not tell. Na janami iti. May he not tell us that? I don't know. So that's what Lord Shiva cannot tell that he does not know. Okay. Anything about the devotee is the interpretation of the translator. Okay. What he won't know. He knows everything else. When I, I don't know you, please don't tell me that I don't know you. So I won't help you. Don't abandon me. That's why the devotee comes into picture anything about me because he's praying no so mom na janami iti we have to take mom atwa asman na janami iti uh, na bruyat okay hmm. sarvagnya padabag yataha kimartam na, na tata bruyat shivaha artvam in this case tvam almost you okay uh, sarvagnya padabag Yataha because Sarvagnya Padabhag, you are the knower of everything. Omniscient is that correct translation, of course. Omniscient, maybe the pronunciation. He is all knowing. Sarvagnya Padabhag, uh, what enhancement it does to Sarvagnya? Uh, probably Sarvagnya Padavi Yuktaha iti Padabhag Prayaha. Hmm? Okay, so we got approximately the anvaya of all words. Okay, so haraha papani haratat shibodattam sadashivam na jana miti no bruyat sarvagnya padabhag yataha. Nice. Once we know the meaning, when we read the verse, it, it is easier to read the verse. Okay, you'll get the kaku also right. Ha. Asannaya Suduraya Guptaya Prakatatmane Sulabhayati Durgaya Namaschitraya Shambhave. Beautiful one. Huh? Asannaya Suduraya Guptaya Prakatatmane Sulabhayati Durgaya Namaschitraya Shambhave. So Asannaya. So this Aya, Aya means see Ramaya for the sake of Rama. Similarly, Asannaha means one who is uh, um, manifest, one who is present help to help us. Asannaya to the one who manifests himself and presents himself to help us, to him, to such a fellow. Okay. Suduraya, yet though he is so near to us, he is also very far. He is <laughs> Suduraya, we have to work hard to get him. He is not easy to obtain. So he is Suduraya. He is appropriately distant from us to make the path for us to obtain him not too easy. That means he expects a lot from us. Suduraya. Guptaya, he is hidden from us. He is not easy to manifest. He is there right inside us. But he is hidden from us. Guptaya. See how the usage. Huh? Asannaya Suduraya. One who is near, one who is far. Guptaya Prakatatmane. One who is hidden, one who is manifest within us. Prakatatmane. Okay. Beautiful you play of uh, meanings by the Kavi. Not just uh, with uh, prasa, with uh, the meanings he is playing. Okay. Sulabhaya. One who is very easy to get for those who have the talent okay ati durgaya one who is very difficult to obtain for those who have the wrong path okay namas chitraya namaha so this aya aya is for namaha so ramaya namaha shivaya namaha similarly etc etc aya namaha all of these are paryaya pada for shambhu Shambhave is very explicitly written. So for Shambhu, which is a direct Paryaya Pada for uh, Shiva. So Shambhave Namaha Kidrishaha Shambhave Kidrishaya Shambhave Kidrishaya Shambhave. I don't know how to decline correctly. So you have to correct it in asking the correct Vibhakti. Okay. To which type of Shambhu? 
ಸೊ ಆಸನ್ನಾಯ ಸುದೂರಾಯ ಗುಪ್ತಾಯ ಪ್ರಕಟಾತ್ಮನೆ ಸುಲಭಾಯ ಅತಿ ದುರ್ಗಾಯ ಚಿತ್ರಾಯ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಚಿತ್ರಾಯ ಒನ್ ಹೂ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಮೆನಿ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಇಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಐ ಇಂಟರ್ಪ್ರೆಟ್ ಲೆಟ್ ಸಿ ವಾಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಎ ಹಿಯರ್ ಮೈ ಒಬಿಸೆನ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಮಃ ಟು ಸಚ್ ಎ ವಂಡರ್ಫುಲ್ ಗಾಡ್ ಶಂಭು ದಿಸ್ ಸಚ್ ಎ ವಂಡರ್ಫುಲ್ ಗಾಡ್ ಇಸ್ ಪ್ರಾಬಬಲಿ ದ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಲೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಚಿತ್ರಾಯ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ವಂಡರ್ಫುಲ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಚಿತ್ರ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಪ್ರೊಡ್ಯೂಸಸ್ ಆ ಇನ್ ಅಸ್ ರೈಟ್ ಸೊ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಮಲ್ಟಿಫಾರ್ಮ್ ನೇಚರ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಟ್ ಸೊ ದಟ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಇಂಟರ್ಪ್ರಿಟೆಡ್ ಆಸ್ ವಂಡರ್ಫುಲ್ ಚಿತ್ರಾಯ ಗಾಡ್ ಶಂಭು ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಟ್ ಶಂಭವೇ ಹೂ ಈಸ್ ಸಮಟೈಮ್ಸ್ ನಿಯರ್ ಬೈ ಸಮಟೈಮ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಅವೇ ಸುದೂರಾಯ ಸಮಟೈಮ್ಸ್ ಹಿಡನ್ ಗುಪ್ತಾಯ ಅಂಡ್ ಸಮಟೈಮ್ಸ್ ಅಪಿಯರ್ಸ್ ಫಿಸಿಕಲಿ ಪ್ರಕಟಾತ್ಮನೆ ಓಕೆ ಆಲ್ಸ್ ಅಪಿಯರ್ಸ್ manifest in us also can be taken atma can be taken as jeevatma or paramatma he is easily attainable by some sulabhaya and for some he is hardly attainable ati durgaya okay let's read it once asannaya suduraya guptaya prakatatmane sulabhaya ati durgaya namaschitraya shambhave nice artists are so great in painting uh, shiva in so many beautiful ways nice okay so with that let us call it a day we'll catch up with the sanskrita vangmaya parichaya and the balance story lines and things like that katha portion etc in the next class okay so we have covered decent amount i think we should be able to conclude uh, lesson 4 uh, next weekend and keep plowing on to for further we keep covering more things i will release some more quizzes today so you can attempt i would i think i have already actually released on the master link the last quiz for the previous lesson third lesson but for the fourth the first half uh, quiz also i will release please try it out after reading uh, it will be nice to try it out so that you practice some okay so with that let's call it a day any questions about this verses or the portions be, be, before that just just wanted to ask you the chambave na uh-huh. it is the fourth i think similar to the asana yeah 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 it is like in the same gurave, vibhakti gurave, gurave na gurave yeah see yeah, yeah. it is a ukaranta shambhu no yes, shambhu that's all i wanted ukaranta. to ukaranta instead of ramaya shambhu. it will come as gurave yeah. or shambhave correct mahodaya everywhere that's it is chaturthi yes. everywhere it is yes, yes. yeah correct thank you yes sir hmm bagini before we did one exercise mm. where vayasya vayasya mm. what roop is that i didn't understand mitram mitram vayasya means mitram mm. but it is a very unique derivation of friend as a friend of the same age ah, okay at least of the same mentality okay and if it is a female friend we have to use vayasya like that okay mm. Thank you. No problem. Okay. Any other questions? Uh, yes, I have a question. Yes. This Vyasya, it is a sub, uh, sh- shashti. No, 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 no. So, uh, that, uh, <laughs> very good. See, Ramasya, uh, like this, we know Syasya largely as shashti, right? Don't get confused, okay? There are some tough words in Samskritam that have such uh, pratyaya sounding endings, okay? This is Akaranta Vayasya Shabdha. So, Vayasya Shya. In Shashti, it will become Vayasya Shya. Okay? Yeah, how do you say it? Like, Vayasya means, means huh? in Kannada, how do you interpret this Vayasya? Um, Samana Vayaska Mitra. Vayaska Mitra. Uh, Samana Vayaska Mitra. Okay. Uh, okay. There is no one single word in Kannada. I have to give you a samastha only. Okay? Okay. Thank you. Uh, welcome. The, actually, what I told was a pure Sanskrit samastha anyway. Mitra is also Sanskritam. Vyaska is also Sanskritam. Samana is also Sanskritam. But we call it Kannada, Bagini. And we blame Sanskrit. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> no, I was thinking uh, uh, Snehita Snehita hmm. Pariyuva something like that okay snehita is also very good snehita is also sanskrit word for 
friend and that also comes in with a beautiful meaning you know what is the original meaning of sneh dhatu sneh dhatu is to mean to stick oily okay so to stick or be be oily okay sneha is derived from the sticky nature of friends they stick to you whether you are good or bad if they are true friends of course you have to be good i am not saying but okay in good times and bad times they stick to you so they are called snehitas okay yeah see everything is engineered in sanskritam nothing is random <laughs> it's lovely language okay so we'll call it a day thank you very much i'll stop the recording we'll do a prayer before that sahana bhavatu sahanau bunaktu sahaviryam karavavahai तेजस्वीनावधेतमस्तु मा विद्विषावह ओं शाति 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 हरि ओं हर हर ओं नमो नमः